This is the Motorized Tornado Maker. That is insane. The most epic tornado maker, guys. Oh, look how it's shooting it up like. Hey guys, welcome back to Incredible Science. Today we have a cool video for you. I am gonna be making tornadoes using dry ice and using some homemade items, including fidget spinners, of course fidget spinners, but some other stuff including power drills and battery powered fans. We're gonna make four different things to create our indoor tornado with dry ice. Now I got this idea from Steven Share, so go check out his channel. He made the original one. He made something that looks like this that was able to suction up some of the dry ice. Whoa, good catch. And make a cloud. I made three other ones, including, like I just said, a motorized one. So you guys definitely don't wanna miss it. But first, I have to actually put a black background against there because I want you guys to really see it well. Now, if you were watching the live stream last night, you saw me do it on the table. You saw it work. It came out so cool. But today it's gonna look even better because I'm on the good camera. We're gonna do it right. We're gonna make it awesome and incredible. But first, let's do the giveaway. So the winner of today's giveaway is gonna get a Hydro Dip Fidget Spinner, a Stay Incredible Pop Socket, a Stay Incredible Fidget Spinner, and yes, today's winner also gets their choice of one of two diamond fidget spinners. That's right, guys. These are the ones I made in the video a couple days ago. Go check them out if you wanna see a closer look. Now it's easy to win. If you were watching the live stream last night, you know the secret word. Guys, go watch my live streams. I chill with you, I hang with you. You see me doing the experiments a day before. You see me practicing for it. You see all the behind the scenes stuff. It's just you and me in this room here at night, live, no script, no edits, nothing. So it's a good time. Usually 10 o'clock Eastern time is when I come on, 10, 10.05. If I'm not on by like 10, 15, 10, 20, then I'm not coming on, just so you know. All right, I hope to come on tonight again to chill with you, to talk about today's video, to talk about some upcoming videos, and to talk about some behind the scenes stuff that you won't hear anywhere else. So come check out the live stream, come hang with me tonight. Now, if you do come to the live stream, I always give the secret word of the day in advance. So it's your hookup in the live stream. Today's secret word is glow. When you hear me say that word, the first time I say it in the video, in today's video, be the first person to comment the exact time that I say it, and you will win all the stuff that I just showed you. All right, now let's get on to the video. Let me show you the four things that I built in order to make our dry ice tornado. So like I said, this was inspired by Steven Chair's video. This was one similar that they made. So I made it, I want it to work. It worked in their video. So I hope I can get it to work in my video. I just took a fidget spinner, put a screw through it, which I had from one of my trick shot videos, and attached three popsicle sticks to it. The point is, as you spin it in the dry ice, it'll suck up some of the dry ice, it'll suck up some of the cloud, and you can make a little tornado out of it. But it just gets better from here, watch. For my second design, guys, I turned it up a notch. I took a bigger fidget spinner, this is a hexagon color change fidget spinner, and I attached six big popsicle sticks to it, similar to the other designs, but this should be more powerful, this should suck up a lot more liquid nitrogen and hopefully make a better tornado. But now we're moving to the big leagues. I'm talking about a motorized fidget spinner, motorized tornado maker, Check it out. Now, actually, this was an idea from one of you guys. Now, I wanna thank you, MotoChamp5 said, you could put the metal thing on a drill. In the live stream last night, after the live stream, MotoChamp5, thank you, said, put it on a drill. And it was an awesome idea, and that's what I'm gonna do. This is the motorized tornado maker. This right here, guys, this is just a metal piece from a cement mixer and I attached plastic spoons using hot glue. So, instead of just spinning it on my own, which worked last night in the live stream, I'm using this power drill. Oops, a couple of spoons are lost, but this should still be fine as long as we don't lose any more. <laughs> All right, complete, complete blooper live. Well, we're not live, but I'm gonna leave it in because that was funny. And it's still awesome. So this was number three. 
And last but not least, it's the simplest one. I'm gonna save it for the end, but it works so cool. I'm gonna leave it for the end. Let's get to making our tornadoes. Uh oh. All right, let's do this. We're gonna start off big with the power tool. Let's do it. Three, two, one. That is insane. Sick. Dry ice tornadoes, guys. All right, so here's the hexagon spinner now. I'm gonna put a screw into it so that I could spin it. Let's see if it creates a better tornado than the electric drill. It might, it might not. I don't know, I've never tried this before. Let's find out together. I'm just mesmerized by this, guys. This is amazing. What I really want to do is attach, now that I see how well this works, I want to attach the drill to this and really get it going fast. I don't know. If... Look at that. Sick. Holy cow. It just catches on and just goes. Like that, oh yeah, like that one. Oh, sick. Right in front of the slow motion camera. Can you imagine if I got this to glow? So cool. All right, guys, I honestly don't know which one I like better. They both came out amazing. Three, two, one. Holy cow. Do you guys believe what you're seeing here? The most epic tornado maker. Guys, I'm waking up everybody. It's 4.30 in the morning. That is sick. Look at that tornado. It's like... It's a real tornado. I mean, it's like thick and visible. Hold on, let's let's get the water warm again. That is wild. We're making like thick tornadoes here, guys. This is no joke. That is a Category 5 tornado on the book. Alright, for this next one guys, I took a pocket fan and I took a propeller. This is like a dollar toy. Using hot glue, and now we have a battery powered fan, which hopefully will suck up the dry ice that I'm about to put in here. Let's do it. Let's create our tornado. If you do it this way, it just blows it away. So you have to do it the opposite way so that it sucks it up. Oh, look how it's shooting it up like that. Wow. Look at that, that's sick. Now we need, oh man, that's amazing. This is hypnotizing, guys. This is seriously hypnotizing. Let me bring you guys closer. So cool. It's literally sucking it up. Wow. 
Wow, looks so good. Isn't that cool? It just shoots it out everywhere. Wherever you aim it. There's our tornado. There is our tornado. Wow, it's a good one. That was a good one. It just lifts it straight up. And lastly, just your average little toy. And lastly, just this plastic toy. It has a blade, it has a propeller on it. And if you just lift it up, it creates a little tornado. It's so easy to do, I'm including it because it's so super simple. You don't need any power tools, you don't need to build anything. Just take this in the dry ice and watch. I think that's pretty cool. Just lift up as you turn in three, two, one. I thought that was awesome. All right guys, I hope you liked this video. Let me know in the comments below which gear, which tornado maker you like the best. If you didn't win today's giveaway, brand new giveaway and brand new video tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern time. Show me the love, hit that subscribe button and hit the like button on this video. This blew my mind. I absolutely love this video. It was so hypnotic to keep twirling it and creating the tornadoes. And you know what? I've never seen this dry ice experiment before, so it was really cool. And it never would have happened without spinners. And again, shout out to Steven Scherer. He was the one who did it originally, him and his brother, with this type of spinner one, with this basic one. But I definitely had fun creating my own, taking it to the next level with the electric drill. So that's it, guys. I will see you tomorrow. Stay incredible. Peace.